Hi YouTube, welcome to jailbreakstation.com. I am going to tell you about how to jailbreak iPhone 4s using the eVision 1.1, the latest version which is available in the market. So first of all you need to go to jailbreakstation.com and click this jailbreak downloads. And you can find download link for Windows, Mac and Linux. You need to download the Windows version. Click here. Once the file download is complete, you will find this file in the downloads and you you can open it and extract it in the same folder or wherever you want. So this is the file evasion win 1.1 and this is the file the executable file which we need to run. So we will be running by double clicking it now you, you can see the evasion window it is showing iPhone 4s iOS 6.1 is supported click jailbreak to begin so only we need to just click the jailbreak and the jailbreak process will start you can see this is the iPhone already connected I'm just clicking the jailbreak button jailbreak process is already started retrieving information from the device to generate jailbreak data it will take a little bit time preparing stage 1 jailbreak data injecting stage 1 jailbreak data waiting for device reboot you can see the iPhone is now restarting rebooting waiting for device to be ready do not touch your device now we have to wait for any message from absinthe evasion now injecting stage 2 jailbreak data step 2 of 3 Uploading side, yeah. Do not touch your device. As mentioned earlier in one of our post, this uh, evasion jailbreak is already having uh, uploading the CDI packages which are necessary. So the first time we will not need to contact the CDS servers. So now you can see the message that to continue please unlock your device and tap the new jailbreak icon only only tap once. So now I am going to unlock this. I have to find out the jailbreak icon. You can see here it is. So just once I will tap it. Alright remounting will start now. root file system mounted successfully injecting final jailbreak data so this is the final stage the device may restart a few times as it completes the process so now we have to just wait
So device is restarting now. Let's see how many time it will restart. You can jailbreak uh, all the devices in the same way. You can see setting up CDA, setting up CDA packages. Again restarting. Initializing offsets. Finding offsets, cleaning up. So this is the final stage. Done. Continuing boot. jailbreak is already completed now we can find the CDI icon you can see here here it is so and this is first time we will be starting the site here now it is preparing the file system Cydia will exit when complete. again restarting now if we will start CDA now the, when you will uh, run CDA first time it will be asking you whether you are user, hacker or developer so being a common user you will be just selecting the user and you, you will need to tap the done and your CDA is now ready and you you can use it like a app store here, here you can see the search where you can search your apps return to CDA refreshing data so in the beginning it will load some default data so you can search then you can manage your sources and packages and you can go to the sections and CDA main so this was the tutorial which I wanted to just share with you Thank you very much. Keep visiting jailbreakstation.com and uh, don't uh, forget to like us and uh, share this video with your friends. Thank you very much. Bye bye.